Hello Libra and welcome to your tarot forecast for November 16th through 30th 2022. I do apologize your reading is up a day late but let's get into it Libra. What is happening for you guys? Show me Libra. All the Libras. What do you want them to know? So we have the two of sacred circles and ace of sacred circles. All oh, right, Libra, you are trying to decide um, between two things <clears throat> or you are trying to decide on like a, a change or a transition in your life, okay? Because with the two of pentacles there, I see you kind of pulled in two directions about something. It could be about uh, a purchase you want to make. It could be around a job situation, okay, since <clears throat> we have pentacles. It could be around a living situation, um, physical. This could be around a relationship, like maybe you're trying to decide between two people that you know. Like, I, it's like I want to get serious. I want to get committed into this connection so like over these next two weeks um some of my singles out there who are already you know dating and and talking to people um i see you really deciding on one person and things developing further um those of you that whether this is around job living situation or purchase you're gonna decide in these next two weeks libra so you're not gonna fill in this distorted energy any longer so let's go deeper into this all right so we have the emperor the seven of cups yeah see choices and and you're you're gonna finally decide libra high priestess queen of swords four of swords and the moon wow not only that libra this is a very spiritual two weeks for you guys okay it's like the decisions you're making here isn't so much um, based on heart or based on logic. It's based on your soul, your intuition, where your soul is pulling you. And it might, and that might have been what the conflict is, is where your soul is trying to lead you is in conflict with your mind, the logic of your mind, okay? And so over these next two weeks, you are going to finally decide and feel very solid in it, okay? Um, some of my Libras out there may be getting a promotion at your job over these next two weeks um, up to a higher level. This is more than like a raise. It's like a, a promotion, okay? Um, some of my Libras out there that have been applying for jobs, if it's like came down to... Um, like you and another person, I see them choosing you, okay? Or are you getting a, a second interview over these next two weeks and they choose you? So um, around job situations, very, very positive, okay? But ultimately, Libra, there's something that you've been thinking about, mulling over, and exploring your options, really trying to um, think of every possible case scenario all the way through for the good or the bad, okay? Even got a little caught up in your head over analyzing a bit, but you've quieted yourself or you're going to quiet yourself over this next two weeks and you're going to finally decide from your soul, okay? And there may be some people around you that don't exactly understand that, but it doesn't matter because you're solid in what you want now and what you've decided. You are absolutely solid 100% in that. So let's pull some more cards. All 
And you know, I also see some of you guys really keeping your plans, what you're doing close to you, not sharing, not really revealing much. Nine of Wands, Five of Cups, Justice, Nine of Wands, Page of Wands, Eight of Swords, yeah, Libra, look, you've made your decision with the world and you're going to defend it and you don't care anymore. Right? You've decided, wow, oh my gosh. Hmm. <laughs> Some of you, this is around a relationship. Again, it could be you've been trying to, you know, just date around and you're talking to some people and now you're really coming to the decision of one person that you really connect with, that you resonate with. And it's like, okay, I, I want to take a chance with you. Okay? And you know, here's your decision, and you're going to defend that decision, all right, and I see um, a lot of potential in this, for those of you where this resonates in that capacity with the fool and the world, both here, okay, um, but yeah, some of you are making a decision about somebody that you want to really get in a long-term committed connection with, and you've assessed the whole situation inside and out, and again, I just feel there's, um, for some of you, not everybody is on board with your choice here. And um, that may be why it's taken you a while. Whether this is about a relationship, a job, a, a, a move, a change to living situation, a buying um, a more expensive item, you know, whatever it is for you, Libra, not everybody is okay with your choice. And that, that's why I see you defending it. And that potentially may be why you've taken some time to really decide this, okay? And that also may be why I see you really kind of keeping things to yourself, close to your chest, is because you already know that not everybody is going to approve or be on board. But I see whatever you choose here, Libra, you're following your soul and when you're following your soul you can never go wrong sometimes the logic of our mind can have us over analyzing and then talking ourselves out of things because we're creating all these scenarios that don't exist and then sometimes our heart sends us into the lion's den because our emotions or desire for something is stronger than our logic right but when it's coming from your soul that that's like urging you on towards your destiny, the blueprint that you've set for yourself this life journey, Libra. And you're going to, you are going to decide and it's going to be successful. Spirit wants you to know that. Okay. And again, with job situations, I do see promotion for some Libras. Okay. Or um, if you've been looking for a new job, this next two weeks is very, very uh, lucrative, high potential that you're you're going to be the one that gets chosen. You get the contract. You get the offer. Okay. Yeah. Um, in some of you, Libra, it may be like you're deciding to propose to somebody or, or you want to marry them and not everybody around you is um, on board with that. But the thing that is, is um, I don't feel that what you're seeking is bad for you. Because sometimes I see readings and it's like nobody is on board for this and good reason for that. But in this situation, Libra, I just see like it's, it's best for you even if there's people around you that can't see it or don't agree with it. Listen to your soul in all dealings over these next two weeks and you won't choose wrong you won't but you've already been mulling this over I feel um, someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change okay yeah see look at you are having success in whatever you choose here but somebody around you 
They don't care. They don't care that you're happy. They don't care that you're succeeding. They just... You know, it sucks when there's people that expect you to live your life the way they think is best or, or through their belief system. And it's like your belief system works for you. My belief system works for me. Let's just live in harmony, right? But this person, they just, they can't. They cannot accept that they were wrong, okay? And that you are happy and that you are thriving in this choice you've made. You have success, Libra. Even if it feels a little risky to you, Quill, get back to the basics. Yeah, that's just quiet your mind, quiet the uh, fears, and allow your soul to just light the path for you. Oh my gosh, look at what flew out as I said that. The sun, happiness and well-being. That is a beautiful synchronicity. And this dagger, fears, worries, and um, tense situations. See, no, don't talk yourself out of this any longer, Libra. You know what you want. You know what's good for you. Um, is This was the best part of your whole reading to me, is what I'm saying. Like, you know, just listen to your soul. It will light the way the sun flew out. And um, then this flipped, and it's like, don't don't let all of this get in the way, especially when those fears and worries it belong to somebody else and not to you. I see success for you in what you're deciding here. I feel you put a lot of thought into this, Libra. You have really searched your options, felt everything out. You know what you want. You know what's right for you. It's time to go for it. All right. The adventure, see? Yup. Lady Spring, brand new energy, blossoming, because you're, you're finally reaching for it Libra and the lighthouse see your soul right there oh my gosh Libra your guys's read is so synchronistic I love it the adventure here you know taking the chance you finally decide you're gonna it feels a little risky but you jump in and it's new and it's blossoming and it's growing and the light of your soul will lead the way. Oh, Libra. So, so good. Ignore the naysayers. It, who cares? They'll get over it eventually. You've got to live your life for you. Phases shine even when you're not whole. All right. Do not, Libra, um, whoever is not on board, don't let it, don't let it kill your vibe. They'll come around eventually, okay? It's more of like they want to control and that's why they're not happy because I see you thriving but them refusing to acknowledge it. Attract, like the moon and the ocean, you attract good things into your life, yeah. See, <clears throat> don't talk yourself out of it. Don't let fear take over. You know what's best for you, Libra. You do, and you're finally making that choice. And it's the right choice for you. So those are your messages. I am sending you lots of love and light. Take care.